My name is Sonia Kilkenny and I'm the member for Karen. Could I uh, acknowledge Tom Mellican, Chair for tonight, Mayor, Councillor Steve Stakos, my parliamentary colleagues Tim Richardson, Nina Springle, candidates with me today, ladies and gentlemen. I'd also like to begin by acknowledging the traditional owners of the lands upon which we meet and pay right my respects to elders past and present. First of all, thank you for the opportunity of being here tonight and um, I want to recognise the, or the organisers for highlighting transport as a, a necessary and important part of the debate we're going to have going into this election. Obviously transport is about many things but ultimately it's about getting to where we want to go and getting there safely. So we want to reduce congestion, improve overall travel times and importantly, improve safety. And let's not underestimate the safety aspect here. We've had several fatal uh, tragedies in Karen, at Station Street and at Eel Race Road. And of course, along the Frankston Line, there have been many near misses and accidents as well. And of course, for our emergency services, boom gates are an absolute nightmare. How many times I've seen ambulances sitting at Station Street in Karen Hill Race Road in Karen, and the fire trucks waiting there as well. And when we calculate ambulance response times, every minute, every second counts. In Karen, there's obviously a number of huge transport projects on the go. We've got the level crossing removal projects at Bond Beach and Karen, and of course the new Patterson River Road Bridge. At the same time, we're using this opportunity to radically enhance and improve the surrounding areas by building the Karen Promenade, revitalising Karen Village, removing the current stabling in Karen and creating brand new community space. We're adding car park at Karen. In essence, we want to, uh, to create a connection to the beautiful Karen Beach, which is currently completely cut off from Karen Village. And let me tell you, I've been working with the community reference group in Karen and the plans for Karen Village and the new Karen Station are absolutely incredible. We've never seen anything like this before. The Karen Station will be the showpiece for generations to come. And this is about generational change. Change is not easy. It's going to be difficult. There are challenges. There are disruptions. There are property acquisitions. But we have the opportunity to create extraordinary upgrades for the next 100 years. This is a very exciting time. We are working now to make the lives of Victorians now and in the future better. The removal of 50 crossings over eight years was a major announcement of the Andrews Labor government. Already we have removed 26 with several more to go by the end of the year. 13 crossings will be removed on the Frankston line alone. Three in Bentley have gone and so too has the level crossing at Sky and Overton Road. See the road level crossing will be next. Over the next six weeks, crews will work 24 hours a day, seven days a week to remove this crossing. It will be finally gone by the end of September. This is allowing us to run more trains more often, enhancing safety and improving the livability of this beautiful area that we call home. Thank you.